Okay, let's go. Move. I guess we're late to the party. Where's the LT? Hanging right up here. Hey! Hey, you ever ask yourself how this part of the world gets so fucked up all the time? I just work here, Dave. To think that Battlefield 3 released 8 years ago in 2011 outstands me to the fullest. Its amazing graphics, perfect sounds and overall flawless gameplay elements is what makes this game an almost total masterpiece. Oh my god! Russian transport! Holy fucking shit! It still stands up to today's standards and goes even beyond it, surpassing many and many newly released games. There's almost nothing bad to talk about, and it definitely paved the way for even greater modern warfare shooters in general. I'd say once in two or three years can we see a release game so ahead of its time in its own genre, and Battlefield 3 was exactly that, in my opinion. The growth in which happened between Bad Company 2, DICE's newest game at the time, to this right here is like jumping into a brand new console generation. Five, three, two, one, suppress it! Good effect on target! Its multiplayer also was just pure fun everything about it. It took every single thing we've liked from previous game and expanded it. But what about its forgotten campaign? A lot of us played it, but it was of course completely overshadowed by its online component. I myself had mixed feelings about the story at the time when finishing it, but after a second complete revisit, everything has changed. This Halo jump mission with the Battlefield theme in the background is exactly what this campaign is all about. It's always epic moments, and you get to play on each side of the war, as the Americans or Russians. Thanks to my bad memories, it's like I discovered a completely different campaign than before, and came out pretty satisfied. My needs for a new grand scale modern warfare shooter definitely didn't help in liking it less. It's not a perfect campaign by any means, but it has its unforgettable moments. Apart from the cinematics where you have to smash buttons from time to time, the campaign is filled with grandiose moments and beautifully shown for a 2011 game. You didn't get that often at the time. From its realistic military boots on ground missions. Oh shit! Ambush left! They're in the trees! People down, taking fire from the left! Enemy behind the rock! Left side! To intense tank missions. Two beautiful jet missions.
Have you guys played the Battlefield 3 campaign and if so let me know if you liked it in the comments below. If you'd like to see more revisit of older games then make sure to like this video and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Thank <laughs> you.